Ollie, we've been down this road a few times, conceding first and coming back to win. Yeah, especially away from home, we've made a habit of it. But um, I think we needed that goal, uh, to be fair. Uh, we started a little bit slow when they scored. I think the boys just knew that we had to up the tempo, that the passing was crisper, better. We spent more, spent the ball, or we used the sides better um, and deserved the, the couple of goals we scored. Harry, victories like that where you have to really dig in, I suppose they can take you a long way in a season. Yeah, definitely. I think obviously the last 10, 15 minutes of the game, we, we had to dig in and we defended well. We defended the box well. They, obviously, they had the Eric where it's Eric and just scraped past the post, thankfully. Um, but for sure, I think we, we deserved three points. Um, we started the game sloppy and then the reaction was brilliant. Uh, we've got to start the game better. We'll improve. We'll, we'll look to, to get better. But the reaction was brilliant. We put them under a lot of pressure. We felt like the goal was coming. And then after we actually scored in the in the first half to, to draw level, we, I felt like we we come off it a little bit um, for the last ten minutes of the of the first half. And then we spoke about it at half time about how we needed to start the second half. And I thought we started it brilliant. We created chance after chance. And um, from 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 behind as a defender, we, I felt comfortable and. The lads was um, creating chances, so you always feel like the lads are going to put the ball in the back of the net. We, Paul's probably ended up scoring the, the hardest chance that we created, but it, it shows what talented um, boy he is and the, the, the magic that he can, can, can create if we, we stay in the game and we feel like we deserve the three points. It's happened time and time again this season where we go behind in an away game and go back and win it. Is there always confidence that even when we go behind, we're well capable of... Yeah, it's always it confident right? because we, uh, we concede the goal really early as well. So. And you have to, yeah, you have to go back. You know, you know, you have to win. You want the three points, so you have to get, uh, uh, you have to get in. Our, you have to play in our, in our space and be difficult. And the reaction that we had uh, in the first half after the, after they scored a goal, it was a good one, very good one. Then second half, we, we were able to score the goal, so I'm really happy. I suppose Cavani's goal would have had you purring, isn't that sort of your goal scruffy sort of? Yeah. <laughs> so what are you saying that I just had a scruffy goal? It's, <laughs> yeah. nah, but that's a centre forward's goal. He's got to be there to score, and uh, that's what he does. I think you can see, if you just watch him, if you have a player cam on him, his movement is incredible, fantastic, and uh, we've got to just get used to using him more. Yeah, second half, when he gets his header, what a save by Areola. So um, it's good to have different options up front. Uh, everybody knows that Eddie is a top-class striker, and there's few strikers like this in the world, and we had the, we had the chance to have one. We know the goals. The hardest goal is those goals, you know. We had talented players, uh, Anthony Martial, uh, Rashi in front, even Mason, that, you know, they can shoot from outside and stuff, but they don't have this, uh, uh, the experience of uh, Eddie, and they don't have the same quality of Eddie as well. Um, so I think we complete each other with the, the players you have in, uh, in front, and uh, Eddie can obviously, he can show his class like he did today, those goals that we needed at the right time, he's always there at the right time, at the right moment, and uh, to help the team as well to, to win. I mean, that, that, that goal was, was fit to win any game. A strike like that, with, in theory, his wrong foot, his left foot, fantastic goal. Yeah. Paul doesn't have a weak foot. Um, no, you, you've seen Paul over now the, the, the last month or so where he's starting to get his, his, his fitness, and honestly, to, to Paul to, to come back into the team and, and, and do what he's doing at the moment, it's, it's great for us. Um, he's a big part of the dressing room. He's a big player for us. We know that he can produce moments of brilliance. Um, and for sure, I, I hope he carries on, and I'm sure he will. Paul, Paul can do that. We've seen it from midfield, uh, switching the play, right foot, left foot. So, he, and But that was a perfect strike and um, fitting to win a, any game of football. It's a beautiful one. It's a beautiful one, for sure. Uh, left foot. Uh, I would say it's the best... Uh, Best one with my left foot, for sure. Um, no, but for sure, I'm really happy. I'm really happy that uh, I can score and I can help the team to, to win the game. Um, but the most important that I'm really, really happy is the performance of the team with the difficult start. It was very hard. Uh, and I think we, we had to find a way to, to get our rhythm and to, to be dangerous against, uh, against a good, uh, a good uh, team. I was full and defensively they, they play very well and it's hard to to get some goals. Well, on a night like this, horrible night, you know, energetic opponents away from home. How big are these sort of victories? The sort of 2-1 away from home? Oh, they're massive. Yeah. They are. Uh, you know, when you count the points at the end of a season, 
the you, you look back oh that was a tight game that was a tight game but you remember it gives so much confidence and uh, morale boost as well uh, to get three points instead of a instead of a draw that easily towards the end could have been because they've created chances David made a fantastic uh, save with his feet and uh, um, but we should have finished the game off before then it's Premier League <laughs> It's Premier League with Manchester United and uh, it's always difficult when to, to play in this pitch, small pitch, uh, where there's not the best team that defend very well as well. And um, we know we, we won't get a, a goal easy, easily, so we had to fight for it. We did it, we did it well and we got the result that we wanted. Top at the halfway point of the season. I know nobody's getting carried away, but it's better than last season, isn't it? I and mean, it shows you the development. Yeah, no, for sure. So for sure it's better. For sure, it's better. We're really happy with what's happening. But we want it to carry. We want this to carry on again. We want it more and more and more every time. We man, never enough. You know, we need, we're still far. We're still far from the from the trophy. And this is Premier League. It won't gonna be easy. We're there, and that's that's the. It was hard to get there. And it's gonna be even harder to stay there. So we know that we have to keep focus and keep working, keep playing, keep pushing, and uh, believe in ourselves. But. Not arrogance, but be arrogant in the way that, yes, we're proud to be there and we want to stay there, but be humble that as well that uh, we're not there yet. We didn't do nothing, you know, we haven't done nothing yet, so you have to keep working. The lads were frustrated on Sunday. They seem to be disappointed with the point at Anfield, but does that point now look better with this victory? Yeah, you have to forget about Sunday. Sunday is past now. We, we had the point, we didn't lose. And today was today. Uh, today we have to focus and we have to get the point. So you have to forget about this game again. Tomorrow we forget about this and we go again. You have to go again because if you think, oh, we win and we think we arrived, that's where we, we're going to drop. Midway point of the season now, 40 points top of the table. I know that's not the be all and end all at the moment, but at least you can see the, the improvement from the midway point of last season. Well, I think that's the, the main thing what we speak about. Um, we don't speak about the table. We, we, we speak about the improvement. Um, you, 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 two years ago, um, you, you probably wouldn't have said that we, we, we'd be challenging at the top of the table for sure. As players, we believe that we can. Uh, we expect that we can because this club expects to, to challenge for the best trophies. So it's all about improvement. It's about improving each game, each session, each training session. We need to improve on things for sure tonight. Again, we can improve. Um, but yeah, like you say, it's, it's nice to have the points tally, uh, but there's a long way to go and there's a lot of improvement to be done for us to, to, to make sure that we're, we're still there at the, at the end of the season. But we don't look at the table, it's, it's game at a time, another big game on, on Sunday and uh, one that we're looking forward to now.